So this question is a simplify question. So simplify or the simplify strategy, first of all, from a recognition standpoint, typically you will use this strategy when a question has between one and three lines and contains either an equation like we have here or an expression. So as soon as I see that scenario, right, a very short question with an equation or expression, what I do is I write down or for this video, I'll write it down. If I were doing it on my own, I'd just do the math here. But you know, for this video, I'll write it down. And then what we're planning to do here is just to simplify what we have. And typically, like I'll do that even really before reading the question. You can read the question first if you'd like. Let's go ahead and read the question first. What value of x satisfies the equation above? So in essence, we're just simplifying this and solving for x. So I'm going to distribute this 2 across the parentheses here. So I end up with 2 times 5x, which is 10x. 2 times negative 20, which is negative 40. Negative sign or negative times 15 is negative 15. And negative times positive 8x is negative 8x equals 7. Combine some like terms. 10x minus 8x is 2x. So those are gone. Negative 45 minus, I'm sorry, negative 40 minus 55. <laughs> negative 40 minus 15 is negative 55 and then we have equal 7 and then of course I can add 55 to both sides here so 55 is gone I have just 2x on the left 55 plus 7 is equal to 62 and divide both sides by 2 here and I'm left with x is equal to 31 so there is my final answer